French restaurant of all five guys. <laughs> so we were planning to go to this French restaurant that one of my friends recommended. Um, she lives in France. I don't think she lives in Paris, but she gave me some recommendations and we were like, yeah, like let's definitely go there. And then Gio comes and he's like, oh my god, I have the best burger at Five Guys, so delicious. And we're sitting there and he's talking about burgers that it makes you want a burger so bad. So um. We decided to go. Pay Did you enjoy your food? I love it. <laughs> she got it. <laughs> We've just made it to Trucadero. Okay. Oh, wow. There it is. Beautiful. So, we're still every here. Hour. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. um, we're 10 minutes, right? We just got crepes. Steph got hot chocolate. Ah, I got something on my jacket that I just found this little mirror. But it's really cold. It was raining earlier, like sprinkling, not like hard raining. So my hair is looking like a mess. But it's cute. I think we got some good pictures. Geo's freezing up there. We got some good crepes. I'm happy. Yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. I know it's really just short little bursts of me showing you guys little things that we're doing. Um, but yeah, we'll show you guys later. Okay, so we're We just got on the bus tour, so you know the one that takes you like sightseeing to all of like the biggest places and all that. So we have a bus tour and then a boat tour, which I'm not like 100% sure what it is, but it sounds cool. Uh, we just hopped on. It's like 11:30. Where is it? That was last night. I haven't eaten yet, so probably like at the first stop, and then we're gonna go eat something. So yeah, I'll let you guys see. <laughs> we just we got super hungry and we were on the bus and we probably had to eat and then we're just gonna just get off anywhere. Of course, it is so windy, windy that we're just running to go anywhere at this point. Okay, so we're going to go. I don't know what he's trying to steal my phone. He was like, um. So the food was okay. I had the spaghetti bolognese and it was probably the best meal at the table. Um, and it was really good. And but this is the best service that we've had since we've been here. Which it's normal, like they don't get like tips, like they get paid a good amount, so they don't need tips, so they're not like as what's the word? Nice. <laughs> So usually they're like, here's your food. And then you have to like chase them down to get the check. This guy like, he's like, how was it? Was it good? He asked me how to be my car. 
Ah, não, mais do que o quê? Não, 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 Okay, I can hardly look crazy, but it is freezing. It's only 50 degrees, but it's so unbelievably windy. I have to tie my hair back. So we are now under the Eiffel Tower. I almost said a vlog because it's so freaking cold. But I had to because we're walking under the Eiffel Tower now. Something nice? I love Paris. Why you love Paris? It's cold. You, you don't like cold? I don't like cold, but it's okay. I get cold. I took my hat off to try to look a little more normal. Oh, it keeps you, keep you very warm there, mom. Oh. <laughs> Steph, you want to get in the shop? You know when you're like throwing a baby in there, you're like, <laughs> that's how I am with this. <laughs> Julian, are you enjoying it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mami? Me fascina. How do you say me fascina in Italiano? Me fascina. Sure. Si. <laughs> So because of the fire, Notre Dame isn't the same anymore. Not that I saw it before, but just from what I've heard. And I feel like it's also such a gloomy day that it makes it look even sadder, but... This is as close as we can get. And then on the other side, it's just a whole bunch of construction trying to rebuild it. On the bright side, lots of crepes and I'm hoping maybe some hot wine.
we are now on our way to the bar. We, <laughs> I fell asleep during the little boat tour. And then afterwards we walked home from the Eiffel Tower. And obviously you guys know we're staying on the Champs Elysees. Huh? Since we're here? Okay, well it can't be far. And we were kind of really tired, so we we're like, oh, maybe that's the end. Then we're like, no, let's go to the bar. So that's what we're doing now. If we find it, because it says that we're here, was supposed to be super close. So, um, keep it posted on that one. So we found the bar. It was actually right next door. Like, we literally walked to the end of the street. We're like, where's this taking us? We literally share the address with this pub. And we've been seeing it every day. And, like, on the weekend, it was super packed. And we're like, oh, maybe it's good. But it's, like, more, like, grungy. So then we were like, oh, you know, maybe we want to go to somewhere nicer. But the drinks were delicious. So what do we see, Mama? So today is our last and final day here. Um, we are currently on the train. Okay, the train. Because it's like outside, it's not below ground. Because we're trying to make it to Versailles and it's a little bit more difficult because of the strikes. A lot of things are closed down, as you know from the other day. So, this is the longer way to get there, but we're gonna make it. Today, our plans are to go to Versailles, Suffolk, and then to Louis. Um, I'm hoping that we can do all of it. It's 10 a.m. right now, so we're supposed to get there before 11. because it has been so unbelievably windy here but we don't know if we're on the right train they just kept sending us train three but it didn't say like train three we're on platform three but it's also platform like eight seven like so we're very confused so we just hopped on and almost everyone here is just as confused as we are because there are no instructions there's no one here to help us and we tried to talk to people and they were like we don't know maybe and we we're like okay so now we're on it and we're trying to go to notre dame because once we get up there, we go on to the metro of Paris, which I guess we're not in Paris anymore. Where are we? I don't know, wherever Versailles is. So we got out of Paris. We're here, now we're trying to get back to Paris. In Montmartre. <laughs> We're in Montmartre, but we are at the Sucker Cur. <laughs> we are Magravan. <laughs> we met a really nice family. It was um, a pain and a half to get up here. 
and now there are more stairs that we obviously have to climb but um by the way we're on the right train and then we got onto the metro anyways we stopped because it took an hour to get here and yeah now we're here it's so beautiful it's still so unbelievably windy which is insane but yeah i don't know it's just it's so beautiful i can't believe that today's our last day i wish we could stay longer like i feel like maybe a month and that might not even be enough <laughs> I didn't record it because it's a church and you're not supposed to, you know. I didn't want to be that person. I didn't want to be disrespectful, so I didn't. But it was absolutely beautiful inside. Now we are waiting for our Uber. We were going to walk and take the metro, but we're on a time crunch. We made an appointment. So, we're hoping to get there soon. Also, my mom's so cute. She gave me half a hubba bubba and half one of those candies that you get from the machines that you put 25 cents in. Because she told me the hubba bubba was too hard and the other one was too soft, so together it makes the perfect <laughs> chewing gum. <laughs> but yeah, we're waiting now. The Uber is about four minutes out.